What's the weirdest compliment you've ever been given? You have great earlobes. Someone told me that they like talking to me because I made them use their whole brain. I dunno. It's weird, but it was nice to hear. My buddies used to tell me my girlfriend gives the best head. Why are you so tall? I am an average height person. Damn girl, you ain't just the meal. Use the whole damn buffet. Nice nips, cupcake. I went to my 25th high school reunion and a woman I knew then didn't recognize me. When I told her my name she said, Oh my gosh. You're so handsome now. Oh. You must have been invited to this conference because you're so pretty. At a particle physics conference organized by my alma mater which invited a few alumni, said to me by a physics Nobel laureate. Thanks dude. Stay classy. With the right makeup you'd make a really good looking girl. I'm a guy by the way. You look like an anime character. Wow, thanks, that's a great complete, yeah, like that show Helsing. With all the vampires. You'd look great in an off-shoulder dress. I'm a guy, but if I ever want to start wearing dresses, I know I'll choose off-shoulder ones. Damn, ya yeah, ass fat. What are your pronouns? It wasn't really a weird compliment, just a really weird delivery. This girl came up to me and told me to look straight forward, stared into one of my eyes for like two minutes and said, nice. My sister's friend told me I had the sense of humor of an old man on his deathbed who was upset because he couldn't find his ex-wife to tell her to f asterisk ck off one last time rolling on the floor laughing. Some random cute girl in town told me I was, a boom ting, while I was waiting at the bus stop after school. I assumed it was an insult at the time. It was only days later that I discovered that she was calling me hot. HTTPS colon slash slash media 3.giphy.com slash media slash tc one zpkuchov 248 slash giphy.gif question mark sid equals ecf 5 e 47 lx 8 lazubdu 510 zl 89 q 81 l 4 ogbhb 9 p 3 jalan 99 vs 5 l and rid equals giphy.gif closing parenthesis. A teacher in high school told me several times that I had a perfectly shaped head. Your penis is harder than old chicken. Your freckles are so sexy. They remind me of my sister. Your handwriting looks just like my brother-in-law's. What the hell am I supposed to do with that information? Your leg air looks sexy. Your eyes alone are worth 2,000 camels for your hand in marriage. Vacation to Egypt. I heard you give really good blowjobs. He was serious. I'm a straight male who never gave a BJ in my life. You remind me of a swan. You look like you're good with your elbows, said by a 50 plus year old man biking by. He then swung back around telling me I should try out for the local roller derby team. It was a crowed Australia Day celebration in the city. Shit was getting a bit out of control and everyone had way too much to drink. I tried to walk quietly by a bunch of fairly aggressive troublemakers, without attracting attention. One of them shouts out, Hey everyone look at that guy. He looks awesome. I want my children to look like him. Fucking everyone stops and looks at me. Some people nod and go, yeah. I had pink eye and the nurse was look into the non-infected eye. You have beautiful retinas. Thank you. One of my first days at a new job. I hear a coworker telling another coworker, I mean this as a compliment, art the real gone goozler looks like she collects dead animals in jars. Still my favorite compliment. <laughs> Minds that I look like a Tim Burton character. At least, I thought it was a compliment because I like Tim Burton's work, but now that I think. All of his characters are undead. Skeptical smiley face. <laughs> you finally look like a human being, it happens every time I get a haircut lol. You're really handsome, said a man who later tried to fondle my dick and balls, I was 18 then. Well I think this may have been intended as an insult since I was curvier back then but some guy told me I was, built for comfort not speed. Given that I would prefer a guy to be comfortable fucking me rather him be quick, I decided to take it as a compliment instead. You smell like watermelon. I'm petite so there was one time somebody told me that I must be, easy to maneuver. 
Not sure if that is a compliment. A drunk woman at the bar was all over me. She was especially entranced by my elbows. She said I had really strong elbows and they were so sexy. She eventually asked if she could lick them. While weird I allowed her, pre-COVID people don't worry. You stink of sex, was really meant as a compliment. When I went to the doctor I goose they were training a nurse. They were about to draw my blood and the older one poked at my veins. She said I had nice, bouncy, veins, so they're easy to see and draw blood from. You must be Australian cause that bikini ain't hiding that bush fire. Your asshole tastes great. Every time I see her, my gynecologist always says, you have such a cute little cervix. I've had a BF blushingly tell me I have a really cute butthole, don't make it weird. So I got that going for me. Wow you're really grown up, from my aunt. When I was 36 yo. Whoa, nice cock. Two young boys ran by me as I was stalking at Walmart. One said to the other, she looks like a boy but with boobs. You look, ominous. The mailman said to me while I sat on the curb reading Time magazine waiting outside my apartment for the mail to arrive. I hope you get hit by a bus. I've been told that I have exceptionally smooth balls. Like two hard-boiled eggs in a balloon full of downy fabric softener. Your butt is really toned, like buns of steel bro. That was from my older cousin a few years ago when she randomly slapped my ass thinking I was her boyfriend walking out of the kitchen. Still kinda creeps me out. She did apologize after she realized her mistake but her compliment right after made it way weirder. I took me a couple decade to realize guys like you are the best. Wow, you're stronger than my dad, my GF, the first time I picked her up. A girl told me that she would really enjoy it if I would put on a Nazi SS uniform because it would suit me and I would look sexy in it. You're so sexy. You reminded me of my mum. One evening about 12 years ago I was on a bus headed down to the financial district in NYC. I can't remember why we were on a bus instead of taking the subway, as I rarely took buses over the subway. Anyway there wasn't many people in the bus and every passenger was able to sit in a seat. Directly across from where I was sitting was an elderly Asian woman. She sat there smiling at me for a couple minutes. I wasn't sure if she was smiling at me or just in my direction so I just smiled back at her. When we reached her stop, she came up to me and said, you are even more beautiful than Meryl Streep. I was so flattered but also tickled. Meryl Streep is a good 35 years older than me. I never thought of her as a beautiful woman but that didn't matter because someone did. And they thought I was beautiful too. You look gay today, by one of my great nan's friends. She had meant happy but it made me laugh so hard I chalked on my drink. Thought she had excellent gaydar. Turns out she just thought I looked happy. Went on a blind date with this guy who's a friend of a friend. He spent the night mostly talking about how nice my top made my boobs look. Yeah that was the last time I saw him. Thanks for watching. See you later.